Yo, Network GT, Zuras representing right now. Coming to you live and direct straight from NYC, Brooklyn, New York. Let's do this. Come out, come out, I'm bad, bad mind, come out, I'm here. Bad, 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 bad mind, come out, I'm here. Totty P a gun, come out, I'm here. Come out, come out, I'm here. Sell bad mind, come out, I'm here. Totty P a gun, come out, I'm here. If I crit them, come out, I'm here. Well, yeah, you know, back in 2015, I dropped my debut project. That was my first major project called the Rasta Prince EP. I dropped it in June 2015. I went to Jamaica to get a vibe, came back to Brooklyn, worked on it, dropped it. It wound up peaking at number 54 within North America among reggae releases. And then the single, which was entitled Come On Tommy Way, was featured on MTV, VH1, um, CIN. It got CIN Video of the Week. It got Vivo Reggae Video of the Week. You know, it opened a lot of doors, a lot of opportunities for me. I performed alongside Conscience, Cranium, um, Linky the First, Egyptian, Charlie Blacks, and I wound up um, a few hip hop artists too: Casanova, ASAP Ferg, you know, KJ Bola, Don Michael, just to name a few. So then, fast forward 2016, I dropped a mixtape now. So now I dropped the mixtape, I got a gem out of the mixtape, a song called Pressure. That's probably my most popular song to this date. When I dropped Pressure, um, it just it just took off like quick. Like everywhere I went, they was playing it. Some people didn't even know it was me. They like, oh, this is your song. Like it was crazy. But um, like I said, it peaked in um Italy at number nine. It was in the um, Jamaica Star, Jamaica Gleaner. I wound up doing a college tour off of it, performed that um Long Island University, St. John's, College of Staten Island, SUNY Canton, did about 10, 10, 11, 12 schools. I can't remember the number off the top of my head, but I did a lot of schools. Then, fast forward to now, I got a brand new project out called Attraction, Attraction EP. You know, I mix up, I mixed up a little bit of every genre. You got hip hop on there, you got soca, afro beats, R&B, and dancehall, but I'm still keeping my sound, my dancehall sound, on the different genres. You know, dipping into different genres. It's out now on every pro on no every streaming service so that includes um spotify apple music um pandora anything you anything you could think of it's on there so for the rest of the year you know we pushing the traction ep we trying to get visuals done for all the tracks it's only five tracks on there we got two visuals done so we trying to be trying to space it out make sure we got enough time to do all of it do all the visuals as well as promote Promote the visuals, promote the content, promote promote the music. You know that's the that's the plan for the rest of the year. As of, as of 2019, we're gonna still push the project. You know I got a few projects coming up with a few other artists. You know I got some shows coming up. I got you know the college tour team coming back. Um, trying to travel out of the country, have a few opportunities overseas. Don't want too much talk about it right now, but you know got a few things coming up overseas and it's all about expanding the brand in 2019 you know i got the clothing out um i got a lot of dope producers on my team i got 3 a.m i got um willis love i got a lot of dope artists i work with like sudan eddie hill um sheem sg you know just to name a few so we definitely working for 2019 and beyond I'm trying to bring it to the world not just for me myself in particular but brooklyn and nyc dance hall Caribbean music in a whole.